Dear Black Lives Matter, I am not ashamed. I am not ashamed to be white. I am not ashamed to be a conservative. I am not ashamed to support our president, and I am not ashamed to support our country. I am not ashamed. I am not ashamed to be a Christian. I am not ashamed to believe in traditional marriage. And I am not ashamed to believe God made men to be men and women to be women. I will not apologize for the color of my skin. I refuse to feel guilty for things I have never done. I refuse to be told that I need to feel sorry for crimes that I have not committed. I have done nothing to you and have nothing to be sorry for. I will not virtue signal to you and I will not sympathize with you. I am Caitlin Bennett and I am only responsible for my own actions. I will not apologize for believing in Jesus Christ. I will not apologize for calling him my Lord. I believe that Jesus suffered for our sake so that we may have life. I am nothing without the Holy Trinity and the only one I will apologize to is the Lord for my sins. I will not sympathize with your hatred of God and will instead pray for your soul. I will not apologize for being a conservative. I will not apologize for supporting the nuclear family, for supporting traditional gender roles, and for supporting Western values. I will not apologize for supporting free speech, the free market, and the right to self-defense. You want to take these things away from me, and therefore I feel no sympathy towards you. I believe in freedom and have nothing to feel sorry for. I will not apologize for believing a marriage is between one man and one woman. I believe that raising children is necessary for passing down the truth to future generations, and they need to be raised by a mother and a father to do so. I will not sympathize with your hatred for the nuclear family and do not feel sorry for entering into a loving marriage with my wife. I will not apologize for supporting my president I voted for Donald Trump in 2016 and will vote for him again in 2020. This does not make me hateful and does not mean I don't value your life. I support President Trump because I love my country, I love my family, and I love my neighbors. I support President Trump because President Trump supports me, and he supports you too. I will not sympathize with your hatred for President Trump and do not feel sorry for voting for him. I will not apologize for attending church. I believe that entering God's home each week and receiving the Eucharist is essential for our salvation. I am nothing without the sacraments and I will not sympathize with your animosity towards the church. I will not apologize for proudly standing up for what is true, and I will not apologize for starting the website libertyhangout.tv so that I can freely speak my opinions without having to feel persecuted and censored by yours. I will not apologize for proudly standing up for Jesus Christ, and I will not apologize for starting the website libertyhangout.tv so that I can freely speak the gospel without having to feel persecuted by you. I will not apologize for loving the United States of America. I will not apologize for saying this is still the greatest country on earth and founded on the greatest ideals. I will not apologize for supporting life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. And I will not apologize for standing for the national anthem. I will not sympathize with your hatred for our country and do not feel sorry for waving our flag. I will not apologize for believing that God made men and women as they are. I will not apologize for believing that we have different roles, different behaviors, and different biological makeups. I will not apologize for believing that we were made to complement one another and become one flesh through marriage. I will not sympathize with your lies that mankind was made any other way. I love people of all colors and do not need to go out of my way to give into your lies to prove it. I am not a hateful person, but do not need to give into your demands in order to show it. Nothing I say will change your mind, and I simply don't care. 
I know what I am and don't need to lie about what I believe in in order to gain approval from you. I love people of all beliefs and all backgrounds and do not need to abandon my own beliefs to prove it. It does not make me a hateful person to believe in the Word of God. Praying for Christ to knock at your door is the greatest act of love and nothing I say will change your mind and I don't care. The only one that I need to seek approval from is God, not you. I am, I am not ashamed, ashamed I have and have nothing, nothing to, to feel, feel sorry, sorry for. Go to libertyhangout.tv right now to watch Caitlin Bennett uncensored. Not only will you get to watch exclusive content from me, but you'll get to say you stood for the truth, you stood against radical leftism, and you stood up for America. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to like and share, hit that subscribe button, and click the notification bell so you won't miss any of our videos. If you want to support my work, you can become a patron at patreon.com slash Caitlin Bennett and receive cool perks like an autographed photo from me in the mail each month. Or you can go to CaitlinBennett.org and get up to 75% off and free shipping on supplements and merchandise to support my work and start living a healthy life. My favorite product? It's Turbo Force because it gives me all the energy I need to make it through a long day of doing interviews. There are tons of other health supplements you can choose from to keep your body healthy during these uncertain times. And check out the website band.video to see uncensored content from conservative creators that have been erased from social media.